try to source as much local food as we can for the actual cook-off competition, but the students are required to bring local seasonal foods into their school lunch meals. And since it's springtime in Michigan, that can be a tougher challenge than in the fall, but we make it work and it really helps the kids understand seasonal availability, Michigan agriculture, and hopefully get a taste for local foods. We have fresh, carrots and um, lettuce and green onions. Supporting local growers is important to keep our farmers in business and to provide support to our economy here in Michigan. That's as important as ever and it's really important for our kids to understand what that means and to get a taste for local foods so that they can support those growers well into the future so we can keep our farmers farming. Michigan agriculture is really diverse. We have the second most diverse agriculture in the United States behind California. So this is a really great opportunity for us to show off what we have and to hopefully grow it even more in the future. Using fresh foods are a lot better, like especially local foods. It's a lot better to use for healthy. We used fresh berries and then the berries were strawberries and blueberries, and then for our wet burritos, the fresh, the local foods we used were onions, and we used lettuce. I would love for the kids to take away a better understanding of the diversity of Michigan agriculture, to know that we produce everything from blueberries to strawberries to asparagus to salad mix, even at this time of year when we've had a late spring that we can get local food into their school meals programs, to their homes, they can get it at farmers markets. So to just have a better sense of the availability and accessibility of local foods in their communities. The, we have a lot of ingredients that are uh, locally grown. Our egg, the eggs, the, um, our peppers and red peppers, the, all the beans in our three bean salad and the strawberries and our fruit salad. I'm always amazed at this event how concentrated these kids are and how quiet the room is once they start cooking. So they always show up early, they always want to have everything just as they need it, and once they start cooking the room is so quiet even though we have 32-ish kids in the room cooking away. It's very concentrated hum to the room. So I love that because that shows how invested these students are in making their meals work and how much they've hopefully learned in the process and that they want to succeed in presenting a good meal to our judges.